Hi, welcome back to Colts Controls. Just to do a really quick video today comparing these. So, I bought the Vizio Mini because I'd already bought the FQ77, FQ36, and I wanted to compare both because I really loved this. Uh, so, I, wanted, I bought this, so I bought this afterwards because this was virtually the same kind of thing. This one's slightly smaller, it's got a smaller remote, and this one only has about six, seven minute flight time, and this one has eight or nine. So, which do I prefer? Without a doubt, this one. I think this is great, but it's too heavy. And because it's too heavy, in flight mode one, it's not responsive enough. Uh, so you could pop the remote, you could pop the mode up to two and three, but then inside it becomes a little bit uncontrollable. Fine outdoors. With this one, because it's dead light, you can fly this in, mode, in speed mode one all day long. I think this is more precise in the air than this one. And the other thing I love about this, is this takes non-proprietary batteries. So you might get a little bit less flight time, but you can buy these batteries from everywhere and they cost, you're probably gonna get three of these for a tenner. Whereas the proprietary batteries for this are not cheap, but I think that this is the better value. This is around 38 pounds this morning. This is 23. Um, you can pick this up for 23 quid. And for £23, I think it's a no-brainer. So, I prefer the, I prefer the finish, finish and build quality of this. This thing's really nicely finished off. The arms are really nice the way they fold. This one's more clicky as they fold. Remote-wise, I think this is a nicer remote, but I actually prefer flying with this. I got really used to this very quickly. It is tiny. With Christmas coming up, and this is the main reason I wanted to do this, people are going to buy the kids the first drones I'd imagine and this is a superb starter drone with this one you've got the problem with, with it being heavier and I think it's significantly heavier than this one you've got the problem of it's it won't respond in flight mode one and if you're flying indoors and you're new to this this is the kind of thing you want it's lighter and it's going to it's not going to cause as much damage and this is very kid friendly size so my little one's eight and he finds this absolutely superb, the control size. So, yeah, I would go with this one. If you're an experienced flyer, then I'd probably go with this one. But I just think this is overpriced. I don't, I can't believe this is so much money. This to me is like a 25, 26 pound drone. I think you're paying for the fact it's got Vizio name on the front of it. And you also, if I can find them, get these stickers. I haven't put the stickers on because I'll probably be selling this. Um, so I haven't put the stickers on. So, but you get them and I think you're paying for the fact it's got Vizio's name on it. It's that little bit of a better build quality. Well, to me, it's all about the flying and this flies better. I, I can safely say, and I've flown for a long time, this thing flies better than this. Even for someone that's flown for a long time. This is really responsive when you change its speed modes. And like I say, I even love this little remote control. The camera on them both is not that great, because they're not to me camera drones. But yeah, it's up to you. I'm gonna leave the cards at the top of the video. There'll be some cards from my original reviews of both of these. Um, if they were the same money, then I'd obviously go for the Vizio, but you've got to look at the cost side of it. And I think it's this. I'd put, if it was the same money, I'd go for the Vizio simply for the fact you get more bang for your buck. It's better made, you get the stickers and everything. But I still don't, it still doesn't fly as well as this. I love these FQs. So I've, I've reviewed three FQ777 products. I've done this, which is the Q36, which I loved. I've done the Q35, which I loved. And I've done the Q4, I think it was Q40, which was absolutely awful. FQ40, which was terrible. Absolutely awful drone. So... It just shows they're not always going to be good. So for the money I'd go for that. If you want a Vizio, I'd buy the bigger one so you can fly it outdoors. You can buy the Shark 809S for around less, well, you can actually, it's less money than this. So I'd possibly go for that. So thanks very much for watching. Have a great Christmas and see you soon.